Hello everyone, this is Tiger Crush, aka the Guy King of W. So welcome back to another episode of Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. Just to recap on what happened last episode, we did this mission right here. I know I'm in the time vault for this episode. Uh, actually, like 10 minutes ago, I was recording the regular playthrough, and then my computer turned off. Um, thankfully, I didn't get too far, so yeah, only uh, only did this mission, and we're gonna jump right into that. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy this video and. It kind of sucks. <laughs> it kind of sucks that my computer turned off. I didn't have the charger in. Um, this is why it's probably best to record on a desktop because your laptop dying would not happen. But uh, yeah, so we're good. This history is far worse than what we've seen so far. Majin Buu was dangerous enough as he was before, but he's gotten much stronger now. Plus, I'll be the judge of that. Mira. I'll be off tracking Mira from another angle. You stay focused on Majin Buu. Yeah, I got you, Trunks. Don't worry, man. Don't you worry. Hold on, actually, let me turn this mic up a little bit. That'll make it a lot better. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, so yeah. Uh, when I was recording, um, like, I beat this mission, and then, like, right after I beat it, snap, poof, gone. Like, I was like, damn. Alright, so Boo snack, Majin Buu attacks, defeat Majin Buu while fighting until a certain amount of time passes. Age 774, let's get it. Uh, what? I did not mean to, I didn't even hit the D-pad. Y'all saw that, right? Like, I took the energy capsule. No, it's not gonna be easy, Gotenks. Damn it. He's stronger than I thought. Wow, I've never seen such power before. Alright, get out of here. Looks like I have no choice. Piccolo, hold him off. Piccolo, I said hold him off. Oh, snap. Right, let me kick him out of the way. Oh, it's time. This is a Super Saiyan 3! It's over for you now, Majin Buu. This is the ultimate transformation. Yeah, you're pretty strong. Let's see how you handle the perfect. Oh, what? what? I don't know. I think we need that weirdo so, to protect us. So powerful. I see why, why Goku and Vegeta had trouble with this man. Oh god. All right. Oh, and hit him with that. Ah, oh, I didn't have enough for the Kaioken. Kamehameha. Now live life like a Kamehameha. Ouch. They don't hit Piccolo like that. Oh. Dang it! Yeah, you lucky, man. Me and Piccolo is about to give you them hands. You lucky time ran out. <laughs> well done. A marvelous show. Thank you, Frieza. Tiger appreciates it. Tiger does. Alright, so. Alright, so that's where we left off. I mean, that's where I was. Now we're going to talk to the Elder Kai to continue things normally because, you know, now hopefully no other bullcrap happens. Um, in the Xenoverse 1 playthrough, the only reason I would go to the Time Vault um, a lot is because if my Elgato messed up the, um, the recording controller. If the Elgato messed up the recording. But uh, since I got a better laptop now, there's no problems with the Elgato, so yeah, let's go. Majin Buu is not somebody you want to mess with. Try to be careful out there. Do you want to go on the time patrol? Of course. All right, get out there and do it. All right. So we're fighting Super Buu again, but this time we got some help from a half breed, if you will. And look, there he is. That man shiny. Yeah, I want the um, I want the Elder Kai's unlocked potential for my character. That'll be dope. Reduce Majin Buu's health to a certain amount. Defeat all enemies. Now, when I read that, like, it was right here when uh, my computer died and said, Nope, mm, F you, Tiger. Dang it! It got to the part where Gohan was about to say, Oh. Ooh. 
Like I ain't got a broly to the left of me. Like I ain't in these streets more than sesame. Oh god, he's mad. Wow, he blocked me with one hand. Whoa. Damn it. He's a monster. Let's see how you handle Super Saiyan 3. Come on, just run into it, Broly. Aw, oh, you're no fun. Haha, -ha, gotcha. Uh. Alright, one more teleport. Uh. Come on, give me enough. Dang it. It was so close to giving me enough to Kyle King times 4. Kamehameha. Ouch. Ooh, Broly should not be that agile. Oh god, he's kick Ah, his attack hits everybody. Isn't that nice? Oh. Alright, here we go. You done, Broly. You done. Come on then. Let's go, Gohan. I got you, fam. Stay down. Aw, he gets back up. He gets back I up. I'll take it. You've demonstrated you can move. Shut up, Frieza. You're only my mentor just because you have cool moves and nothing else. Even though I don't use any of your moves. So, uh, yeah. Honestly, I'm just waiting until I get like Beerus or Goku's my um instructor. Then it's gonna be lit. Oh, I already, I already know what's gonna. Alright, excuse me. I already know what's up. Oh snap! Nah. Ah. Uh, yep. You never see this man outside of hell. Even when he has the power to be in any timeline, he still comes back to hell. Like. It's like a criminal returning to the crime scene. Oh, oh. oh, I was about to turn into a Super Saiyan. Vegeta! Where's Goku when you need him? Oh yeah, this Oh, this is sweet. So it seems the only way out of this is through you. You're looking for a fight. You've got one. I hope you're ready, creature. This is sweet. Because instead of uh Don't blame me if you get go because you're too close. I don't want to talk over Vegeta. But yeah, like since you know if Fusion Reborn was canon, this would be after the Majin Buu Saga. But the way Janemba is messing up the timeline is he came before. Like, that's, that's dope. That's why Goku isn't here. Because Goku, um... Was Goku dead? I guess that doesn't make any sense, does it? That's... Well done. A marvelous show. That's why most of the movies are not canon. Because it doesn't make any sense that Goku was dead. But it was after the Majin Buu Saga. Because you know Elder Kai gave him his life. So Goku Goku could be alive. Okay, Vegeta wanna finish off Janemba by himself. Yo, what? Yo. This man has that kind of power. Looks like he finally had enough. And he was powered up too. <laughs> yeah, my character is like Batman. If uh if you guys haven't noticed. I only do it I only do it to the voice actors of Christopher Sabbath though. Like if you notice, I only disappeared after Piccolo after I helped Piccolo with Raditz, and then I disappeared after Vegeta beat Janemba just now, so Yeah. If your voice if you have Christopher Sabbath's voice um character, if you have his char if if he's playing a character, I'm disappearing for that character. 
That's what I'm trying to say. God damn it. All right, so um, yeah, let's let's continue on. Let's continue on. Um, but don't slack off. There are incredibly strong enemies out there spoiling for a fight. With that in mind, before you head out on patrol, again, I've got a homework assignment for you. Do you know about TP medals? What the hell, Elder Kai? Good. That'll speed things up. Your assignment is to collect 15 TP medals. Bring them to me when you're done, okay? Collect 15 TP medals and give them to Elder Kai. Wow, Elder Kai. It's not like the universe is in trouble or anything. What, you're hanging around your feet for go collect 15 TP medals. Medals can be attained by completing new parallel quests, going to the Rift in Time, and so on. From time to time, you can also receive some by taking special lessons. Go take a look around and see what you can find. Wow. Well, that just <laughs> that just puts a stop to things. <laughs> Alright, I'll tell you what. Um, I'm going to do the CP medal thing next time. I thought we were going to continue on with the Majin Buu saga, but Elder Kai just giving us homework out of nowhere. Like, what the hell, man? Like, they need me out there, but... Whatever. Um, we'll do that next time. Let me let me squat squat up with uh Elder Kai real quick. All right, y'all. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, definitely hit that thumbs up. That would be greatly appreciated. And I hope to see you all in the next video tomorrow. I've been tagging you, Crush, aka the God King of W's. Peace and stay zen.